assuming everyone in here had at least some high school experience if you're here right now. Um, today I'm making my claim on why high school students who participate in extracurricular activities will obtain a higher level of education and have a more positive school experience. An extracurricular activity can be anything from sports, band, choir, theater, any club, anything extra that's still involved with the school. Um, I would like to start off with some statistical evidence provided from the National Center for Educational Statistics regarding educational policy issues. These activities offer opportunities for students to learn values of teamwork, individual and group responsibility, physical strength, and endurance, competition, diversity, and a sense of culture and community. Extracurricular activities provide a channel for reinforcing the lessons learned in the classroom, offer students the opportunity to apply academic skills in a real-world context, and are thus considered part as a well-rounded education. Um, I kept finding more and more statistics and facts about how a person who participated in any kind of extracurricular activity just became a more well-rounded person and came out with a better experience. Um, participants were also more likely to than non-participants to aspire to a higher education. Two-thirds of participants expected to complete at least a bachelor's degree, while about half of non-participants, the kids who are not participating in extracurricular activities, expected were not expected to go on to a higher level. Um, another example I found was from the University of Illinois professor who studies the sociology of education, stated high school sophomores who were rated by their teachers as having good social skills and work habits and who participated in extracurricular activities in high school made more money and completed higher levels of education 10 years later than their classmates who had similar standard test scores but were less socially adapted and participated in fewer extracurricular activities. Um, another professor from the same university says that soft skills such as sociability, punctuality, consciousness, and the ability to get along with others <coughs> and participate in activities was less than those who didn't were on a team or in a club. Um, another fact, finally, I have found a well-documented, fully researched paper that provides expert opinion and statistical information from the University of, of Iowa and an author named Mary and she was, wrote a book called High School, Extracurricular Activities, and College. Not only do extracurricular activities help students that are already successful in school to further excel, they also help students that are at risk of dropping or flunking out to remain in school. Mary performed a study of college-age students who were involved in extracurricular activities in high school to discover if there was a fact of correlation between involvement in activities and academic achievement. She concluded after 292 college students that participation in extracurricular activities enhances both the intellectual and social development of the students. Through her own research, she discovered that athletes attain higher grade point averages than those students not in athletics. In addition, she found that the national survey performed by Durbin in 1984 showed participants in extracurricular activities in high school received better grades when they were participating in activities than when they were not. So she's basically just saying when they're in off season, kids' grades tend to drop, and when they're in season, they tend to be more focused because of their allowing time. When you have four hours of practice and six hours of school, you don't have much time left. So kids had to learn time management. Um, she concluded that extracurricular activities are components that make students stay in school, attend regularly, and benefit because they are less discipline problems. High school athletes are considered um, some more of the top performing and stay more out of trouble, along with other kids who are in clubs and theaters. They're less likely to be involved in drugs, alcohol, and tobacco abuse, and serious offenses with the law. Extracurricular activities give students positive activities which will be involved and they'll spend their time in a productive manner. Um, I've also talked with the head coach over at El Dorado um, for water polo. And he's noticed that probably about after freshman and sophomore year, after people obtain their PE credits, they tend to quit. And about half those girls end up either having to drop out of school or end up going to rehab, pregnant, or they just all him just drop off. Their grades aren't good. They end up not going on well at all. So I believe that having reviewed all the research I found and talking to a coach that has been dealing with the same issues over and over again, 
that extracurricular activities are beneficial for high school students and will continue on in their future.